This lesson is on mentally adding 100 to a number. When we add 100 to a number, instead of being able to write it down, we want to be able to do it in our head. It's really not that hard, we just have to understand how it works. So let's look at some pictures and some numbers before we try it on our own. If you look at the picture at the top, you see 100, 200, 210, 220, 221, 222, 223, 224 in 110s and ones blocks. Next to it says plus 100. So let's go ahead and draw that out and add it up on the other side. We had 100, 200, 210, 220, 221, 222, 223, 224, plus 100. If we add that up, we get 100, 200, 300, 310, 320, 321, 322, 323, 324. Our answer is 324. If you notice from our picture, the 100's changed. We added a 100, but the 10 stayed the same and the 1 stayed the same. So when we add 100 to a number, the 10's digit does not change, and the 1's digit does not change. Only the 100's digit changes and it goes up 1. And you can see that in our number here. We started with 224, and when we added 100, we got 324. The 100's digit went up 1, but the 10's digit stayed the same, and the 1's digit stayed the same. Let's look at another one. This one is 100, 200, 300, 310, 320, 330, 340, 341, 342, 343, 334, 345, plus 100, 200. Let's draw it out one more time. So we said 100, 200, 300, and 10, 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, plus 200. So I'm going to draw 100, 200. Let's add it up and see what we get. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 510, 520, 530, 540, 541, 542, 543, 544, 545. Our answer is 545. You can see that our, our 100's changed. We gained two more hundreds, but the 10 stayed the same and the 1's stayed the same. So again, the 10's digit does not change and the ones digit does not change but the hundreds does we went three up two more hundreds to get to five hundred the four stayed the same and the five stayed the same in the ones place now that we've drawn the pictures out let's see if we can do it in our head on this side on the left side there's a number what we're going to do in the right column is add one hundred to each of these numbers so if we add 100 to 200, we get 300. The digit in the hundreds place went up 1, but the tens and the ones stayed the same. They stayed 0. If we go from 342 and add 100, we get 442. Since the hundreds place goes up 1 and the other digits stay the same. 296. 296 would be 396. 
the 2 goes up to a 3, and the 9 and the 6, six stay the same. 561 turns into 661 because the hundreds digit needs to go up 1. 777, if we added 100, would be 877. The 7 turns to an 8 because we added 100 in the hundreds place and the two sevens stay the same. Let's try one more grid. Remember, we're going to start here and we're going to add 100 over here. So 499 would be 599. So we're going to add to that hundreds place. 622 would be 722. Tens and ones stay the same, but we change the hundreds place. 847 would become 947. The 8 becomes a 9, the 4 and the 7 stay the same. 980 becomes 1080. The 10 stay the same and the 1 stay the same, but the 9 went up one place, the 10. Don't forget to add your comma after the 1 for the thousands place. If we added 100 to 100, we would get 200. That concludes our lesson today on mentally adding 100 to a number.